Hey everyone, I'm Andrew. I'm talking about Like a Boss, which is a new film. It's been described as kind of like a, uh, a chick flick, which is okay by me. I'm, I'm not sexist. I like women, so a chick flick I can watch one. No, no problem at all. It's been getting mixed reviews, so should you go and see it? Hmm. Well, check this out. It's a light-hearted comedy about a couple of friends who start up a cosmetic business, but when poor decisions mean they uh, lose money, they have to join up with a billionaire investor, and that's when things start to fall apart. The cast is really likeable. I especially loved uh, Tiffany Haddish. Selma Hayek played a great villain, and Jennifer Coolidge and Billy Porter were fab, so seven out of 10 for acting. Kind of middle of the road plot wise and a bit predictable at times, but the one liners are hilarious and crude, so seven out of 10 for that. Fairly standard filming techniques, no great set pieces or, or anything like that, so seven out of 10. When it came to costumes, no real wow factor in that or in the sets, although they did manage to make um, Selma Hayek very busty, so six out of 10. Overall, nothing particularly challenging or riveting in this film, but it was funny and it held my interest throughout the whole um, hour 20 minutes. Uh, so seven out of 10 for entertainment value. Averaging all those scores means Like a Boss gets 6.8 out of 10. So Like a Boss is not gonna change your world, okay? It's, it's got nothing that's gonna be particularly challenging. It's not gonna um, change the world order or anything like that. But the preview audience I was in laughed all the way through, which is a good sign. It's got some really funny lines, Jennifer Coolidge, um, says the funniest, I won't tell you what it is, but it involves butt plugs, so you know, there's always fun in that. Uh, so yeah, I'd, I'd say go and see it, have some fun with it, and uh, don't forget also to check out my website, andrewwhiteside.com, for more great content.